All right. So now we're back at the free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta main page. We just finished the certification project of uh, building a palindrome checker. And now we're on to learn modern JavaScript methods by building a football team, pardon me, by building football team cards, right? So one common aspect of building web applications is processing data sets and then outputting information to the screen. In this sports team card project, we're gonna learn how to work with document object model manipulation, object destructuring, event handling, and data filtering. This project will cover concepts like switch statements, default parameters, object.freeze, the map method, and more. All right, so let's get to it. All right, so we see right here, we've got something that says team stats, and then, uh, all right, so this is made, uh, we know this company is out in California, but for some reason, they're saying football instead of soccer. I'm sure it has something to do with the fact that coders and programmers are actually not anywhere near athletes. So why not just confuse everybody? Anyway, so for any North Americans, we're talking about soccer. We're not talking about American football. So, yeah, we're going to have something with the team, the sport, the year, the head coach. We're also going to have this little drop down with a filter. You can see all the, this is all the uh, players right here. And then we've got uh, players with nicknames right here. We've got the players that are the forwards, which is the position. We've got the uh, midfielders. We've got the defenders. And we've also got the goalkeepers. And you can see on each card, we have the name, we have their position, we have the number, and we also have their nickname on it, right? So let's get to it. All right, so now we're on to step one. And we'll see you next time.